Hello everyone and welcome back to more Steven Plays Outlaws. On the last episode, we captured Bloody Mary Nash. We captured her. We stabbed her. We stabbed her right in the face. And it made me feel good because I had had such a difficult time with that level. In fact, I'd say probably harder than any other level, actually. Um, getting one-shotted by the boss when you have, I believe, full health uh, sucks. Pretty bad. But we captured her and our point total put us over the edge to get to deputy, which means that we can get into that special house. We're not going in there yet, but we can at some point. All right, uh, next up is Buckshot Bill Morgan, but I wanted to point out that there's actually, um, there's actually something over here that uh, I never really pointed out. You can go down here and there's an entire other section down here of all these like bottles and things like this. And then there's this room. I don't know what this crap is. Um, I'm just saying that it's down here. You can open up the map and you can see that there's stuff here. Um, there's just... You know, I just wanted to point it out so everyone knew that it was at least here. Since I'm trying to be fairly thorough with the, uh, the Let's Play, I thought I would show that off before we jump in today. Alright, are you ready for some fun? Are you ready for some action? Are you ready for some western killing? Then let's take on Buckshot Bill Morgan. It's night. We're approaching... We're approaching on the wind. Is that a thing that people say? I don't know. It's uh, it's dark though. I'll give them that. Um, once again, we start with, you know, basically nothing. So we only have our our two guns, our pistol and our rifle. Don't have a rifle scope either, which is going to make this part a little difficult because in the campaign when we had, what is I'm going to say, practically the exact same level layout. At least we had a rifle scope. It made it a little easier. Now we don't. Also, check out those very realistic shadows. The beautiful, beautiful game from 20 years ago. Do have a medical bag? Um, I don't know if they can see me in the dark. I can see just well enough to kill them. There's probably guys up in the tower, but the problem is you can't really see that well. And th this is a time when the scope would be helpful, but I, I don't want to just waste ammo. Also. Does this place not literally the same area from the campaign? Certainly looks familiar. Got that guy. There's a guy in there. He's dead. I can't even... I can only, like, barely see these enemies. Guy there. Got him. Just trying to make sure I don't get shot. Let's move towards the light. Is anyone else in here? I'm not getting shot again, man. I'm not I'm not dying. Not today. Got a gold bar. Some more bullets. This is uh this is gonna be a lot more difficult because it's at night. It's gonna be considerably more difficult. Got that guy, there's someone that was shooting at me and I'm not sure where. And it's super dark. Probably that dude. He's dead. That's not a door. Thought it was a door. I don't think I've actually gotten shot yet, which is nice. There's a guy in there. Now he's down. This is actually going pretty smoothly. Um, I don't want to jinx it yet. <laughs> I don't want to jinx it yet, meaning I do want to jinx it, just I want to give it a little time before I jinx it. No one's in here. It's creepy, man. There's oil everywhere, so you can... I mean, obviously... Poop. Can't seem to get up there. You might be able to get up there, but I'm not gonna I'm not gonna deal with it at the moment. Got the rifleman up there. Pretty sure I still haven't been shot, knock on wood. I'm taking him out left and right. And also, I'm pretty sure I'm hearing unique dialogue. Have I already found the guy? I think I have. Where you at, bud? Where you at? There's a guy right there somewhere. And he's a big one. I think I got him. God, I can't see. I'm, I know I can use my, my light. But it doesn't give you as much... As much light as you would really like... Like it to give. And you can actually kind of see a little bit further, I think, with it off. 
Have I been shot yet? This is wild. I've never had this much luck with the game. Looking good so far. Let's turn this on. Oh man, I'm starting to get a little creeped out. S apparently snaking along the ground is is the way to go because I have not been hit. So uh, let's see if we can get this open. Need the steel key, which we only have the brass key at the moment. Oh god. Where are you at? Where are you at? There's one guy over there. Someone else was shooting at me, but I'm not sure from where. It could have been the rifle guy that shot at me. I don't know. Jesus. It's exciting. Alright, I don't want to use up all the ammo here. Got him. Sheriff's badge. All right. Let's rock and roll while we got it. This is not going to be around forever. Double barrel shotgun. That sounds pretty good right now. Got plenty of ammo for it. Got that guy. Where are you, Marshall? Got that guy. That guy hurt me a little bit. That's a nice yeah, he's that the guy is like here. I'm surprised, honestly, that he's so close. There's a ton of gold and, and stuff over here. It's gonna give me a good score. Nobody in here. Nobody in here. I got the steel. I got the steel key. Okay, I'm moving around pretty quickly at this point. My badge is gone. I can see a guy over there. Don't have a rifle scope, but I don't need it. Oh, he started to move. Maybe I should have shot at him. Got him. Okay. Woo, things are going pretty good right now. Uh, let's switch back over to this. Don't see anybody. Okay, this is where I was before. I'm going to drop down to get that medical bag. Keeping my eyes peeled. Oh, I see a guy way over there. I think I killed him. It's so dark I can barely tell, but I think I actually did get him. Whew, this is going is going pretty smooth so far. Um, and I don't know what I did to deserve an easier time. I'm like right above this guy or something. So I already went in here. This place seems basically cleared out. Guy down there I killed. Doing pretty good. I haven't been in that room yet. I've been kind of avoiding that room, but everything else seems done, so. Are we good? Still fully possible to just like hey, that's a nice hat you got there. Hey, is that he under me? Good on me? He must be under me or something. Or up there? That seems... Is that not a death trap or what? To just... That guy's dead. There was a shotgun guy or a rifle guy up there. Okay, that looks fairly safe. It's usually pretty dangerous to just wander around like this. But honestly, everyone seems dead. After having so much trouble on the last episode, I'm very grateful to have a lot less trouble this episode. That's very nice. Very, very nice. Okay, um, there's still plenty of, like, healing supplies and stuff around, too. My issue now is figuring out where to go. Um, I went back around this way. And it sounds like... I can't get in there, though. Is there a door or something I'm missing? Did I go in here? There's a, sh a normal shotgun, which, uh... Nothing against the normal shotgun, but I'd rather have two barrels than one. That guy had... That guy had a rifle scope. That's where that was hiding. Um, what am I missing? I'm clearly missing something. I can hear the voices coming from this direction. But I can't... 
I can't get in there. I also don't want to run out of uh, out of juice for my thing. Um, I haven't been able to get in there. Just walk over here and see. Was there some way to get in there? That was a door that closes. There's blood that's like hanging in the air here. All right, there's got I I hate to feel like I need to jump through the window, but like I don't hey, see it. Mark, has anybody ever told you you look like Abe Lincoln? <laughs> Actually, yes, I have heard that from commenters mostly. Now, I think I can jump through that window. I'm not entirely sure I can. And I don't want to, like, break my legs doing it, but I... F it just seems... Okay, it's not happening. Doggone it. I need to get in there and <laughs> no idea how to get in there. Oh, wait, I haven't been in here. <laughs> wait, is that it? Ah, oh, hold on. I need a shovel. I haven't found a shovel, have I? No, I haven't found a shovel. But if I if I were to find a shovel, I think I can dig here. It's the kind of thing that uh, it looks like the kind of spot that you can dig in the game. Um, that was uh, something that's in level two. I never really get a chance to show it off. Yeah, you can't jump up there. Okay, so now I'm on a completely different quest um, for a shovel. I don't even know if there's one here, if that's what I'm supposed to do. Um, but it's, I guess, it's in my opinion, like, worth a shot. But the level itself actually seems quite small. Um, at this point, I'm just really hoping that I can find wherever it is I'm supposed to be going. Because I got the key there. That doesn't do anything, go anywhere. Okay. I've officially checked everything. Um, and the map is pretty small. Uh, it looks like there's an underground section or something up over here. You guys see this? There's like a part of the map. Maybe it's outside the map? Maybe there's a shovel out there in the great big countryside. I'm going to turn off this light. And uh, against my better judgment, I'm going to walk around out here. Oh my god, actually there is. Holy crap. Uh, give me this. I have a rifle scope now. Holy piss. This might actually be it. Wait a minute! I'm glad that I bothered looking at the map! Oh, it's spiders. Why is it always- Ah, why can they attack me from out there? Why? It doesn't make any sense! Stupid spiders! Freaking like invincible spiders! Seriously, this is ridiculous. Spiders are damaging me. Oh, it's just loot. <laughs> I would normally be excited about loot. I'm still vaguely excited about loot, but I wish I had a shovel. I'm just wandering around in hopes that I'm going to... Oh, there's spiders out here too. Nah, I'm good. Y'all crazy, man. I ain't dealing with those spiders. So I did discover something cool and extra. Um... I don't know if I'm actually after... <laughs> don't know if I'm actually after a shovel or not, but either way, I'm gonna have to just... I'm gonna have to look around for a little bit. There's no secrets here. So, I'll, uh, I'll bring it back in, or have Dan bring it back in whenever I figure out what I'm supposed to do. Wait a minute. Oh! Okay. Man. It's wild because, you know, the level seems pretty small and you're just sure that you've seen everything. I kept coming up the stairs and going this way. I have never once walked this direction. Well, guess what's over here? Doors. Of course. Uh... This was where the guy was that I killed. Okay, so that's how you get up here. And a shovel! Oh my god. This door is stuck. So this door requires a crowbar, which we don't have. However, we do have a mother friggin' shovel. Where was that spot again? It was... It was on the ground in the corner somewhere. It was behind here. Yep, there it is! Okay. Now we should be able to... 
There's spiders, aren't there? Son of a gun. Why are there always spiders? Okay. Dug it up. Frickin' spiders. I'm gonna just punch them, I think. Get in there. Come on, James Anderson. Time to punch some tarantulas. Woo! Let's party! You want some of this? Everyone's favorite spaghetti western <laughs> trope is uh, digging a hole and punching giant tarantulas. All right, that, however, had the crowbar, which was the entire thing we've been after as of a few minutes ago when we realized we needed it. So switching back over here. Now we know exactly how to get through here. Oh, it's on. That's the guy. That's the guy. Should I try and take him in? I, uh, I don't want to die. That's the other thing. Dying sucks. You should give up, Marshall. I'm the best in the way. So that was terrible, and I'm going to shoot him. Uh, if anyone has a problem with that, too bad, because... Screw this. Remember when I said I was going to shoot him? And then I threw dynamite at him? I really should have shot him. I'm back, butthole. And I'm ready to make you pay, but with a gun, why did I throw dynamite in the first place? Should I use this? Maybe I should use this. He is buckshot Bill Morgan, which means that he uses a shotgun. Um, is he dead? He's dead. He had the sawed-off shotgun. Holy crap. Holy crap. He I, Honestly, the thing that... That I'm a little salty about is I totally could have killed him the first time. And instead I was like, nah, maybe I can get him. Maybe I can get him. The answer was no, I couldn't get him. Alright, let's do it. Good bit of gold. Some kills, some wounds, some bounty. It's a good score. Uh, up to 15,000. Is that enough to make it to sheriff? It is. We're a freaking sheriff feel good about that. Done and done, baby. Holy crap. We managed to take out Buckshot Bill Morgan. Still have only captured one. But to be fair, it's so freaking hard. Like, on good, on good difficulty, you could probably do it. But on the other difficulties, little, little, uh, little hard. We're still missing one, and uh, that is what we're going to be taking on next episode. So next episode, join me again as we continue martial training and take on Wanted Dead or Alive, Spittin' Sanchez. He's going down.